Hello everyone. Today I'd like to do a quick tutorial on SF Edit, a Shining Force 1, Shining Force 2 save state editor. The first thing you have to do is make sure you're in the appropriate mode. Right now we're set to the Shining Force 2 mode. If you want to do a Shining Force 1 edit, you just click switch and that changes it to Shining Force 1. So we're in Shining Force 1. In the Shining Force 1 edit, uh, some of the capabilities are grayed out, such as changing your kills and defeats for your characters as well as the caravan inventory. Both of these omissions are logical because neither of these exist in the original Shining Force 1 game. Something else that's grayed out are these modified stats. Modified are simply the stats post equipment bonuses. So you take your attack plus whatever your your weapon bonus is that gets your modified attack. Um, I don't actually know why these are here because even though in Shining Force 2 you can edit those I never noticed them making any impact. The game will recalculate the modified stats based upon the equipment when you look at your characters. But it's there. So usage. Very simple. You go to File, Open. I just have a test save set up, so we're going to use that. And now we can see all the stats get dropped in here. I can select my characters here from the drop down menu. I'm going to just cycle through them so you can see all the different character stats. If you want to make a change, simply go in and make the change. So instead of 37 HP, let's say I want 50 HP for May. There we go. Nice and simple. Uh, she never died, let's say. And let's give her some equipment. Uh, she's going to be equipping the mystery staff. That sounds fine. Seriously, it's that simple. If we want to give her a spell, we can do the same thing. Let's say I want to give her Catan, level 3. We're good. If we want to eliminate whatever she's currently holding, we can just go down here, go to Empty, and then Unequip. And that will remove whatever she had equipped previously and remove that item from inventory. One thing I want to especially point out with this is it is a great utility to have if you are a fan of Gens or Gens Plus, because in those emulators, Lemon or Lemon or however else you want to say his name has a cannot equip glitch, which means that once you unequip the Dark Sword, he cannot equip another weapon. Using SF Edit is a great way of getting around that. You simply select whatever weapon you want to equip, say Runax and you click the equip button and voila lemon now has a rune axe and it's equipped and his stats will be modified once you get back into the game that's about it for sf edit again it's a very simple straightforward program uh, how you access it or get it is in zofar's domain i will put a link in the description otherwise hope that was helpful and have a good day